Peter on the online could be like, <laughs> and then and then I've done it, and I've done your research, mate. Greatest Hits album, that's that, we're talking, it's the, all of Uncle B, all of yeah. Against the Rods, and then all of Love Live Life. Mate, I'm telling you, I'm telling so every song. No, they're like fucking wild though. Like, no, but Newcastle look wild. Tomorrow. Yeah. Tomorrow. All right, uh, mate. Speak to you in a bit. Bye. And on comes end of straight afterwards. That, ladies and gentlemen, is Cam. Oh well, that's Cam. Cam the cameraman. We haven't seen him for a long time, but he'll be making his return very soon. Because we're going to end up, baby. Trying to film me making a coffee for the first time in my adult life. What do you want? <laughs> so one thing that to my knowledge, to my memory, or to my, yeah, memory, I guess, um, that my old man has always done is drink an instant coffee at work or just in the morning or, or just cause right before bed, you know, he loves the taste, he friggin' loves it. I think it's rank, but the older that I get, the more I think I really should be drinking coffee. Like I really should. But the thing is I'm the kind of guy that if you take me to Costa, Starbucks or whatever, I'll get a smoothie or if I'm really feeling it and it's really cold, a hot chocolate. I don't do coffee. I just don't. I just don't really like the smell of it. I've got a really blocked nose still. And I can still smell the fact that I do not like the, 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 the smell of this coffee, you know? I've got nowhere to put this, I'm actually gonna leave that in there. So I figured I'd just try it. Straight black, instant coffee. Plenty of people are gonna look at this and go, well, why the hell are you trying to drink that? Make a latte. Do I look like I had the facilities for that, big man? So in the hope that I start to drink less energy drinks, cheers to my first coffee as an adult. <sighs> nah. It's just not for me. Oh well, I tried. Wow, that's brighter than I thought. You know when I set the camera up, I was like, I'm gonna have a nice, like, sun-kissed shot. Nah, no chance. Flip here, that. I have an idea. I've not gone into my cupboard for stuff like this for a while, but we have hazelnut drops, toffee drops, uh, vanilla drops, and butter biscuit drops. All MP. Obvious, obviously. What do I go for to make my coffee bearable? I like toffee drops the most. I've used toffee drops the most in my lifetime. But who the, who the hell wants toffee coffee? I'm going toffee. How much do I put in? Two, three, what, five drops? That's a lot in a small cup of coffee, no? Oh, it smells rank, man. <laughs> Fuck it, I'm putting a whole pipette in. I'm doing it. Okay, I put way too much toffee drops in, but that's actually a hell of a lot better. I mean, it's still a no, but it's better. Fuck. Let's try this instead. How's that? Can you see me? You can see me. Cool. So, body weight aside, all of that kind of stuff aside, um, we are going to talk a little bit today, uh, or right now, for the next couple of minutes, 
maybe, about my diet and nutrition for the next two weeks. It'll be less than two weeks by the time that you guys see this, um, and it's already been, it's less than two weeks anyway, it's more like one week. I've already been doing it for like a week. Um, so to cut long story short, I have been eating uh, meal prep pots, uh, which I'll make an entire video about next week. Um, because pretty much I was too busy with my work when this first box arrived, so I couldn't film that one because it would just take up too much time. That's just how this YouTube thing works. I'm getting another one in a couple of days. So I'm going to film that one instead, you know. In the run up to Texas, I'll be tidying up the diet, I'll be increasing my cardio, and I'll be on point with my training. Why? Because I don't want to get to Alpha Land, and I don't want to be training with all these people that are shredded to the bone, been on the good stuff, you know, for longer than I've actually been training altogether. I want to be surrounded by all these people and just like, look like ass, basically. So I'm just tidying things up a bit. Obviously this is all quite a spontaneous last minute trip. I wasn't expecting it, um, which is great. It's a nice way to live life and, and I'm very excited for it. However, it does mean that I'm not physically prepared for it. You know, I, I don't even have a suitcase that's big enough thinking about it. That's tomorrow's problem. Anyway, for now we are going to be doing cardio every other day. The reason that I'm doing it every other day is because I don't have very long and so I kind of want to make it a bit more intense. Not only that, I also really enjoy it. Anyone that knows me, been subscribed to me for a while, will know that I love going on the spin bike. It's one of my favourite things to do. I can plan out my day first thing in the morning, I can answer some emails, answer some texts, answer some phone calls, which I do need to be better at anyway. So setting that time aside to actually respond to people, whether it's a, a friend or a family member or just a client, right? I need to set that time aside every single day and me going on the spin bike all the way back when in lockdown, um, when, when this channel first started kind of building some momentum, that's when I did that. And so getting that back, I'm, I'm actually really looking forward to it. So the prep pots are these ones here. I'm actually saving the tubs so that once this whole like thing is done, I can, I can, uh, what's it called? Keep these pots and actually put my own meal prep in them. I've kept a couple of these just so I can show you a couple of what they are. Uh, but I'll go in more depth in another video in the very near future. So calories, uh, a lot of you will be wondering, or some of you might be wondering, none of you might be wondering. I'm going to tell you anyway. Calories are only at 2,000 calories, ladies and gentlemen, 2,000. That might not sound like a lot, it's not a lot, but when I'm doing it for a couple of weeks, max, like, it's really not that deep, I can cope with that. I only eat two and a half thousand calories as it is. I'm 170 centimeters tall, I weigh like 180 pounds, or I do right now anyway, I was a little bit more, but we've lost a few pounds, like, bearing everything else in mind, the amount I'm on the bike, the amount I train per week, activities just throughout the day in general, 2,000 calories for a couple of weeks, I might be a bit hungry, but it's like a 500 calorie deficit, it's really not that bad, but it's what I'm gonna do to lose the weight, and it will work. I've said it before, I will say it again, this is not rocket science, ladies and gentlemen. Do the simple things over and over and over again, and you will see results. So the next task of the day is to actually go on the spin bike. As you can see, I'm in my phenomenal Christmas pajamas right now. Uh, I'm gonna get changed out of those, go on the spin bike in my joggers, because it's freaking freezing, man. Like, turning the heating on costs money, but getting warm and raising your heart rate, doing it that way, that's free, ladies and gentlemen. So I'm actually transferring some files here, uh, which I am pretty much just putting, I'm clearing a hard drive so I can take that hard drive to Texas, basically. So that is transferring, it's gonna take an hour, um, so I've got an hour to just chill on the bike. Let's go. All right, I'm ready, more. I have just had a thought, I reckon, if it's cold, I, I think I like it. So what I'm gonna do is grab some, Ice, obviously. Now I don't know if this is gonna work, right? I don't know because I've never done it before, but it tastes, because I've put so much toffee drops in it, it tastes very sweet. It doesn't really taste even like coffee anymore. So like, I can smell it, but I'm gonna put a couple of ice cubes. Ice cubes in there. I'm gonna pour the rest of my coffee. I feel like I should like actually shake it, but flipping heck. Genuinely reckon that I'll like this. I actually think I stand a chance. Daddy, you're proud. Cheers. I'm still scared though. Nah, it stinks more of coffee now, I'll put it in a metal thing. No. Oh, nah. Ugh. 
stay tuned in a video coming soon. Ah, <coughs> coffee adventures are not over yet. I'm determined to like it. Well, will I be getting commission on that then? Maybe. Perhaps. Introduce yourself. Oh, they know who I am. They're OGs, I guess. They're, they're real OGs. I've already told them earlier on in the video that. Oh, <laughs> the okay. Cam yeah. cameraman is actually making a return. <laughs> Alexa, stop. <laughs> so. Ladies and gentlemen, the time has come. You can't really see us from over there. Yeah, so, how are school with your food? They're an eight. I'm a size eight. How tall, how big do you expect them to be? I'm five seven. So, <laughs> we have a nougat. <laughs> not, not some nougat. pre endubs na 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 with Kill the Cameraman. Cheers. Very Christmassy though, isn't it? Well, that's why I suggested it's it. Nice. It is quite nice, isn't it? Do you want another one? No. Why not? Cam is the biggest end up fan you will ever meet in your entire life, right? Um, explain to them about your end ups uh, obsession. It's not obsession, they're just the greatest group this country has ever produced, and I think quadruple platinum really shows that. So. Yeah? The triple Nobel Award winner, I uh -huh. think, as well. So. I've spoken about you. Oh, you never met Cam? They're like, no, I'm like, I call him like Cam the Camelman. <laughs> they're like, no. <laughs> Right, you ready mate? Yeah. Let's go. Arena security officials at ranking 10 have been granted immunity, but will more than likely still participate. Commencing at the siren, any and all antics, including shouting na na ha ha, vigorous mothering, intoxication, toxic behaviour and drag texts in your ass, will be good. na 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 ha ha, and may any dance be possible. Life gets better than that, to be fair. Have you ever been to a gig that good? Never. <laughs> Genuinely never been to a gig that good? Never. Unreal. Breakfast and a half, that is, you know. So we have a sausage, bacon, egg, well, scrambled egg, fried egg, English muffin, uh, and some beans. Are you having any beans? I'm having some beans. One, two, three. The atmosphere, the music, that, that that was just insane. It was it was so so good. So so good. I hadn't seen Cam all year. I hadn't seen Cam since Christmas last year. So like the entire of 2022. Not seen him, not seen him for a while. We used to jam, absolutely smash end dubs in the home gym back when I lived there a couple of years ago now. I nearly moved out like two years ago now, you know. What the hell? It's crazy. Anyway. Great to see you, Cam, and great to uh, to have that experience with Cam as well. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I've got plenty more videos, but it would just be a boring old um, reel of me just going, ah, you know, so that's it. That's making my friend's dream come true or making him realise his dreams or making dreams a reality, whatever I wind up calling it. I don't know. Thank you all so much for watching. I hope you have enjoyed. Like, comment, share, subscribe. This was more of a vloggy episode. Um, so the next one, uh, who knows what's in store. Plenty of cool things coming, especially in Texas. Thank you all so much for watching. I'll see you in the next one.